Hey guys, Jay Wade here, and I just wanted to give you a quick review of this Tyrode 62 and a half inch lightweight aluminum tripod. Now it's touted as a vlogging tripod, and of course it's got a 360 degree panorama ball head. It holds up to 17.6 pounds. And I'm looking at replacing the tripod that I have now, or just adding this one to my inventory. If you want to see how well it works, or how well it doesn't work, stay tuned. <laughs> So portability and versatility is what I was looking for when I was interested in selecting a tripod. Now this tripod here is lightweight and aluminum. It's not much different from the one that I have now. So currently I have the Sunpack Travel Light Pro. And this one here is available at Best Buy. And when I talk about versatility, I also talk about the utility of how fast can I deploy my tripod in any given situation. So here you can see me unpacking and unloading the Sunpack Travel Light Pro. Now I picked this Tyro tripod up on Amazon and it was real affordable. The folding of it works the same. Now I want to get directly into the versatility of this tripod. Now here you can see me using it with the clamp for a cell phone. The adjustability of the ball head is what's critical in this situation. This ball head is equipped with both a coarse and a fine adjustment so you can get it just right. Now these adjustments may seem a bit unnecessary to the average consumer, but this is a pro feature. Anytime that you do any type of landscape photography or something like that, you want to make sure that you can get the horizon correct. Now this is one of the features that I say makes this tripod and ball head combo top notch. Now the base of the ball head comes with your standard Acura Swiss attachments. This is a quick release. The base is already equipped to accept your DSLR camera or any type of mobile cell phone attachment. Now the bubble level sits right outside. This is a great place for it because on lower end tripods you'll see that the bubble sits inside and once you put your phone on top you will not be able to reconfirm that you are still level. Now the panning on this head is buttery smooth. It's going to get you pretty close to a fluid head, but just remember that it's not. So you can get some smooth shots if you pan across any type of environment, and I'm sure you'll be happy with the results. This here is just an open practice field. There's a single adjustment knob to move the neck up and down. I don't know what that strap is on there for, but I'd be interested to find out. Travel tripods that have a that are missing the A-arm usually have trouble with stability. This one doesn't have much trouble. Here you can see my old tripod and the challenge I have when lifting it up. Did I ask what the strap was for? The leg adjustments has a satisfying click. I can tell that this thing is really, really sturdy, and that's one of the most important parts about having a travel tripod. It does come equipped with the regular counterweight hook so you can put your bag on it and that way it keeps the tripod grounded anytime you're using it. So overall, I'm very impressed with this tripod. Coming in right at $59.99 after a $10 coupon that's available for you on Amazon, I couldn't be more happy and satisfied with what I got. So I can't talk to the durability of the tripod because I've only had it for a little while but if something does change I will update my video and update my review so if you enjoyed this hit the like button and if you didn't leave me a comment below of how I could improve thanks for watching I'm Jay Wade peace